special thing that allowed Persian language and culture to survive was, remarkably, this book. It's called the Shatnabe. A collection of tales about Iran's pre-Islamic kings. The characters are part mythical and part historical, and the book tells of their heroic deeds against divine and human forces. It's a poetic rendition of these supernatural tales, historical tales, romances. It's really a most magnificent grown-up storybook. Shahnameh is the soul of Iran. It's the absolute essence of being Iranian. It's a masterpiece of Persian literature and history and language. And to most Iranians, certainly to me, it's like a Bible. Although it was written in the 10th century, the characters and tales are still much loved today because they provide a link between the present and 3,000 years of Persian culture. I'm starting my journey here in Tehran because I want to get a taste of this magical storybook. I'm in a South Tehran tea house where a thousand-year-old storybook is about to come alive on stage. The Shahnameh, the Persian Book of Kings, is part myth, part epic history, and Iranians can't get enough of its adventures. It's central to their sense of identity. If you want to understand the story of the Persians, you need to dive into the Shahnameh. The performance is about to begin. <laughs> Tales from the Shahnameh are retold by storytellers in theatres and tea houses all over Iran. And the man who wrote it would have been astonished to learn his life's work would still be performed and read a thousand years later. 